Hi, this is Phil Stone, and this is the Phil Stone Training Series on Capture Sites. Driving traffic to your website is expensive. No matter how you do it, it's going to cost you either money or time, and chances are it's going to be both. If you're working with a company-supplied site, you don't have capture capability, and that's a big issue. So you have no way of knowing who visited, and you have no way to follow up any visitors, and that's a huge negative. So driving traffic to a site without capture capability is just not effective. You need a capture site with a registration form and autoresponder email follow-up, period. Now this video will go over two systems that I use for personally setting up capture site capability. The first one is the instant sales system, and you can find out more about it at philipjstone.com forward slash instant underscore sales underscore system. By the way, remember, Philip is with two L's. You can build multiple capture sites and floating forms using simple templates in this system. They have a very cost-effective autoresponder program that's included as well. And they offer a free trial period for you to try the system. It's $29.97 per month after if you keep the system. Tremendously affordable, doesn't go up in price, as many sites as you want, floating forms as well as capture sites, and the autoresponders don't increase in cost as you develop a large list. Now, the other way, the other system we're going to talk about is WordPress. And as far as WordPress goes, a self-hosted WordPress blog site is the only way to do it. And it's easily set up to be a capture site. Here you're going to need a hosting service, a custom theme, a form generation system to create those registration forms, and an autoresponder email program. Now you'll find directions to build all of this in this video. Now first of all, let's talk about the instant sales system and the floating capture forms. Since you can't alter your corporate site, you can either place a floating capture form over your corporate site, or you can set up a simple capture site itself that may redirect to that site. Floating capture forms do not alter the host site at all. They sit hovering over the site and give you the ability to drive traffic directly to the unique URL that you establish for the floating form. The visitor arrives at your site and the form opens. It can include a video of introduction and custom copy to engage your visitor. All kinds of customization ability exists with the floating forms. You have your customized header. You can put in a video in the center. There's your copy. Write out whatever you want. And of course, there's your registration form. They click that and you get notified right away and then your autoresponder email system kicks in. Now, here is one of these sites that I have in the instant sales system that I use as a capture site. It's a full header. There's my YouTube video for this site. There's the capture form. And there's a footer that you can write copy. You can put copy in the center of it. You can choose pictures, as I have done here. All kinds of customization available as well. And they have a bunch of different templates that you can select from when you're building one of these capture sites. Now, once your prospect registers, they can be redirected to a sales page, a second page that you create in this system, or they can be redirected directly to your corporate site. Now, here's a WordPress capture site that I built, philipjstone.com. One of the things I like about the WordPress format, of course, you have the ability to put in all kinds of plugins and all types of customization, but it's a multi-page system. So you can see just by my little lines there, I have home, welcome, Phil Stone, super tools, contact Phil, different categories, article magic, social networks, WordPress, all of that. Building the site right now. But one of the most important things here is that registration form. You give people a reason to register. When they input their information, you've got control of the lead follow-up and you're building a list. That's exactly what you want to do. Now, two hosting programs I want to talk about for WordPress and I have to say I lean towards HostGator because it's got a one-click install. Very, very cost-effective. But HostGator is one. philipjstone.com forward slash host underscore gator. And Bluehost is another. You can check them both out. philipjstone.com forward slash Bluehost. GoDaddy has a system that you can do this with as well. You want to try that out? HTTP colon forward slash forward slash philipjstone.com 
forward slash GoDaddy. Now, as far as themes go, I'll tell you, I dug around all over the place, found all kinds of pricing for custom themes, and what I chose was the heat map theme. A lot of reasons for that. Affordability, the fact that I can do it with multiple sites, just many things. The main deal here is it's a one-time fee, and you have as many sites that you can put this on as you'd like, and each one can have a totally different look. They have preset skins that go along with this system, so you can... Pick a color scheme that really is very attractive and bang, you can have a site up and running in a matter of minutes and they can look totally different. You could have 10, 15 of them totally different than each other. There are dozens of widgets inside this theme that allow you to really customize the look and feel of it. Love that too. And they have active support forums. That's a really important part as well. By the way, the creators are very, very involved. They stay up to date with everything, give you free updates, and as a matter of fact, if they make major changes, they allow you to incorporate the major changes in your new themes as well. Very, very good support. The way to find out more about the heat map theme is philipjstone.com forward slash heat map underscore theme. By the way, if you're getting involved in WordPress and you haven't really played with it a whole heck of a lot, there's a system that I use when I'm talking to people who are new with it. There's so much to learn. It's, it's, a, it's like a language. But we have some free basic WordPress training available. philipjstone.com forward slash smart underscore media. That's actually a browser that you get, which is, by the way, very secure and fast. But in addition, you get the training library. No cost whatsoever, totally free. And as a matter of fact, you can use the smart media as a freebie giveaway on your website. Give that away to people, a lot of value, doesn't cost you a thing. By the way, there's an income opportunity tied to it as well. If you want to find out about that, connect with me, I'll let you know how it works. Now, AWeber is another system that I use, and the reason that I use AWeber is it has a form generator that is really very attractive, and they have a great autoresponder service as well. Now, it starts at about 20 bucks a month, but keep in mind, it will go up from there. That's one of the reasons why the instant sales system is attractive. If you have more than 500 subscribers in AWeber, you're going to increase by 10 bucks a month. In the instant sales system, doesn't matter if you have 500 or 5,000, the number's the same. But this has some definite benefits. One of the reasons why I actually use both systems. And you can try this for a dollar. They have really attractive templates and form generators. You can put a registration form on your site in a heartbeat. And you can change it, adjust it, customize them. Lots of capability. That's one of the reasons why this is really an attractive system. The autoresponder options include link tracking. So in other words, if you're sending out a link in your autoresponder email, you can actually go to your back office in AWeber and see how effective that link was, how many people actually clicked through on it. It's really great support here. If you need anything, very, very simple. You can just call them up. Easy. Or you can email them if you want. philipjstone.com forward slash AWeber. That's A-W-E-B-E-R to find out more about that. Now figure it this way. If you want to send people a link, sending them a link on Facebook, for example, you want to send them a link to a capture site because how in the world are you going to know if they actually went to the website? If you're sending a link in mass email, same exact thing. Don't you want to know who actually went to the site? Give a link to a friend to check out the site. And instead of having to chase that friend down and say, hey, did you look at the site? What did you think? You know if they went there because if they went there and they registered, that's telling you right away. They're interested. It's someone you really want to follow up. If you're driving traffic to a site with pay-per-click, my gosh, if you don't have a capture site, you might as well just throw your money out the window. You need to have a way to know when people go to the site, and you need to be able to capture their contact information so that you can continually work with those people. Because as you probably have heard, most people don't act the first time they're told about an idea or an opportunity or a program or a product. They need multiple exposures, and that's exactly what the autoresponder program does. So this way you, you get contact information and the autoresponder, only way to work. If you're promoting your site using Twitter, driving traffic with Twitter, and I do that very effectively, I use an automation system. You can find out about that at philipjstone.com. Very, very effective way to drive traffic. If you're promoting your site there, you've got to have a link that the people are going to go to, and you want to have a way to find out who's interested, who actually went. The people who register are your best leads, no question. 
driving traffic using a URL and a business card. Same thing. You hand somebody a business card, you got your website on it. How in the world are you going to follow that up if you don't have a capture form on your site, the capability to get their information, and then you get notified and communicate? How could you possibly do anything? If you want to use a URL on marketing materials, same kind of thing. You want to put your URL on flyers or maybe a billboard if they'll allow you to. Whatever you're going to do, you definitely need to send people to a capture site. Now, as far as resources go, this is what we've covered in here. And I'm going to give you an extra one, too. philipjstone.com forward slash light screen. That's a really great, very simple, free program that allows you to take screenshots. So, for example, if you had that and you were watching this, when I give you all these resources, all you'd have to do is just take a quick screenshot. You can actually do that with hotkeys. Really very easy. So, download light screen maybe pause this video right here download that come back take a screenshot you've got all of it I mean the easy part is each one of these resources is philipjstone.com forward slash whatever the resource is hope you've enjoyed the video hope it's helped got a lot more in the training series look forward to seeing you on the next one bye bye